everyone, thanks for checking out another bonus episode of The New Marketing Show and us on Instagram TV. Today, let's talk about some of the benefits of podcasting. So, you know, not everybody can be a John Lee Dumas. Not everybody can be, a, you know, a big time podcaster where sponsors are clamoring to go and give them lots of, you know, ad revenue or, you know, or product spots, etc. You know, we can't all be NPR, Serial, Gimlet, you know, any of that stuff. So, how do the rest of us use podcasting to go ahead and increase our business? So the one thing that Kevin and I have done with Trinity Web Media is we want to use podcasting as a business development tool. Now, I know that this is a little bit different than how a lot of people use it, but we want to use it as a business development tool so that when clients ask us questions about maybe what's the best uh, WordPress host, we can say, oh, we talked about that on our podcast on episode 33 of The New Marketing Show. Or when they ask us specific questions about marketing tactics, you know, we can point them to specific episodes where they can go ahead and get answers. And in getting the answers, they can actually learn a little bit more about our personalities, how we operate as a company, and, and what we're all about. So it's a super powerful medium to go ahead and do that for positioning. So again, if your goal is to launch a podcast and have and monetize it with sponsor money and ad revenue and all of that that's a long road that's a very very long tail it is lucrative but get be prepared to do all the work for that most people don't reach critical mass with their pod with the podcast so they can go ahead and 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 get on track to to attract the money coming in so while you're working towards that have another goal. See if you can't use it for business development. Hey, thanks for checking us out. See you next time.